Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing, but now let's talk about Cardano itself. We're going to be discussing what exactly is happening with the price of ADA and of course what is yet to come. You know, I've been seeing your guys' comments, you know, Crypto ZX, where are the Cardano updates? You know, I just don't want to give you guys an update because, you know, not much has happened in the Cardano's price, but, you know, due to the overwhelming support and, you know, the request, I'm bringing this update for you guys and I got a lot of things to cover in this Cardano update. So, you know, if you are a holder, you do want to sit back, relax, and enjoy the show and share the video um, to the Cardano community. So if we're looking at the majority of the market today, you know, we're seeing uh, some green across the board, some red across the board, and not much is happening. As far as Cardano is concerned, it's down about 1.1% over the past 24 hours in USD comparative, but that's not what we want to be focusing on. We want to be focusing on some other key metrics that, you know, a lot of people are mentioning. And, um, you know, I got to talk about some things that, you know, just have been bothering me about some of the comments that have been coming in. So, you know, if you're looking at the price of Cardano right now, currently sitting at 49.1 cents, um, down about 1.2% over the past 24 hours in BTC comparative. You know, we're seeing Cardano remaining in the top nine cryptocurrency market ranks with a market cap currently sitting at $17.2 billion. And the 24 hour trading volume is currently sitting at $276.5 million. But what exactly is next for the price and what do I really want to get off of my chest? That's what I'm gonna be talking about. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. And as always, just a quick disclaimer, anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrency so i want you guys to be taking a look at btc's price so you know bitcoin um let's give you guys a quick reminder we did see that um, you know massive move towards the downside for btc um you know closing the cme gap at, at thirty nine thousand uh, dollars but as of now just quickly kind of briefly going over B bitcoin you can see bitcoin is having a hard time getting back from the 38.2 fibonacci retracement level and if you're a regular viewer on my channel you know the importance of the 38.2 fibonacci retracement level so you know of course we would love to see the price of bitcoin getting back into the 38.2 closing back above that and then of course pushing up to some yearly highs so now that we have btc out of the way let's take a closer look uh for cardano and what i really want to talk about so you know first i want to say you know thanks to your support literally thank you to each and every one of your guys's support by liking the video i'm really you know sharing the videos leaving such good feedback you know my video has picked up you know some um you know eyes from one of the uh, big news articles uh, as far as cryptocurrency um you know articles go and you know media platforms etc etc and they are talking about you know what my overall take on cardano is so you know this is something i'm really really overwhelming so i want to say thank you to each and every one of you guys for um you know doing that because without your um you know support this is not possible so you know what i want to talk about today is the negative tone that is in the market right now for ada and that negative tone is super, super important to notice right now, because right now what we're going through is the uncertainty phase. You know, the uncertainty level right now is increasing once again. You know, the uh, amount of excitement that we were seeing at the beginning of the, um, I'm sorry, not even at the beginning of the year, at the end of quarter four of last year, you know, that amount of excitement is nowhere to be seen right now. A lot of people are bearish. A lot of people are not showing attention to ADA. People are, um, you know, chasing green candles. And this is where, um, you know, the patient part comes into play. I've said this from the beginning. There's one of the updates that I made, which was super, super undervalued in terms of reach. It did not get the reach that I was expecting it to do. But, you know, it did catch uh, a few articles, uh, you know, journalists that, you know, caught on and, uh, you know, took what I said and posted it on their platform. So, you know, appreciate uh, those uh, people too for showing love. But, you know, what I discussed in that was the previous bear market and you know, the massive amounts of consolidation phase we went through. Uh, and then, you know, we saw that massive spike towards its all time high, where all of the sudden, you know, when this exciting, uh, you know, rally that we saw happen, this is where all of a sudden everyone started turning mega bullish on Cardano, this and that, all of the sudden everyone is Cardano Moon Boys, but um, you know, before that, before that massive explosion, no one was paying attention to ADA, and that is something very, very similar as to what we're seeing. People are se seeming to forget what we have seen over the course of the last few months. Let's go back down memory lane, especially for the newcomers coming to the space. October 20th, this is the price we're going to use for the example. What was the price trading at, uh, you know, in October? It was definitely not 49 cents, 
it was sitting at 24 cents. And if we bring out the measuring tool from that range, people that bought back then are still up 100%. Yep, you've heard that correct. Of course, we're seeing, uh, you know, a pullback. And why are we seeing a pullback? You know, the interest level right now for ADA is decreasing despite the overall market you know, not looking too bad, but the interest level in terms of ADA is decreasing. The amount of negative comments coming in are increasing. So the sentiment is switching up. And this is where the people that actually believe in Cardano's vision are going to come and take advantage uh, in terms of dollar cost averaging in at a cheaper price. I'm seeing a very, very similar price pattern as to what we saw prior in the previous bear market uh, because guess what I'm not just someone that is just looking at the charts and speaking about it I was actually in that previous bear market I was actually making updates for Cardano around that time and I've literally documented Cardano breaking towards its all-time highs you can literally go back to my old videos and see all of that so you know it's, it's nothing new to me you know I've been covering Cardano for quite some time and what you're seeing happening is a key resistance level uh, where we are having a hard time actually staying above you know the last retest was January 11 so we're approaching a month we're approaching a month's time since we haven't seen that resistance of being retested and this should just give us uh, itself an indication that the overall momentum for cardano is not there right now but there's the famous saying be greedy, greedy while others are fearful be fearful while others are greedy we're still in the bear market cycle believe it or not yes you know surprisingly uh, some people don't think we're in a bull market but yes guys let me wake everyone up we're in a bull market Market. yep we are in a bull market look at majority of the markets everything is up and this is the start to the bull market but you know for Cardano itself it hasn't broken out of its bear market cycle and that ends once it gets into this blue zone and it's not been able to do that two different rejections not one we saw two different rejections for ADA and this should give you an indication how important the um, you know 61 I'm sorry 78.6 Fibonacci retrace really is for the price of Cardano so my eyes are all on this right now we have significant amount of support built up um, you know from the previous consolidation phase and of course uh, from the previous cycle but you know the next major support is going to be around 45.6 cents if Bitcoin sees more downside um, you know we could potentially see Cardano breaking its way back down to this uh, 45.9 cents which we did see just a few weeks like week and a half ago so this is what you guys want to be looking at right now. Um, but, you know, I still think, um, you know, Cardano is going to be shocking a lot of people this bull market exactly like how it did last cycle. Um, it's just, you know, a matter of time where, you know, patience is required. Um, you know, if you're looking at Cardano's DeFi, um, you know, I think Cardano's DeFi is extremely undervalued considering its market valuation 17.2 billion dollars um, looking at its to total value locked i think it's quite low but speaking it speaks for itself right not much interest right now in ada and that does correlate um in the overall tvl for its ecosystem but that's how i'm looking at it um you know patience is required at the end of the day um and i do think that you know cardano is going to shock a lot of people it just requires of course patience as long as you have done your due diligence and research and have invested what you can afford to lose then patience is your number one key to follow let me know down below what you guys think thank you to each and every one of you guys for showing so much support love you all see you tomorrow in crypto zx and peace out